Hello, this is Mike Panaki with Network Protocol Specialists. And in this video, we're going to take a look at a program called TCP Traceroute. Now, we know with regular Traceroute that we use ICMP to trace a path through the network. And this can be very useful for finding out what routers we're going through and how we're getting from one point to another, especially across the internet. Now, with TCP Traceroute, what we do is we actually send a TCP SYN packet using the port that we specify. Where this is very useful is trying to find things like where firewalls might be blocking ports or whether we can get all the way to the server using a particular port. So let's take a look. If I type sudo tcp traceroute and I type secure.email srvr.com, that's my email server, and I put port 25, which is SMTP. This is going to follow the path through the network and find out how do we get from my office to my mail server using port 25. And we see down here that we get a SYN acknowledgement back from the server. That tells us that our TCP SYN frame got all the way to the server and that port is open on the server. So if I'm trying to establish a SMTP connection with this server, I know that my path for port 25 is good all the way through. Now, I'm going to come over and I am going to go to my firewall and I'm going to turn on a filter for port 25. And we're going to come back here and I'll type clear and we will rerun exactly that same command. So we're going to find out what this looks like after we set up the rule on the firewall. So in this case, what we see is that we get as far as our micro tick router, which is running our firewall, and we don't get any further. So what this tells us is that that rule that we created is working. So if we're concerned that a port is being blocked somewhere along the path, or we want to validate that a port is being blocked somewhere along the path, TCP Traceroute is a great tool, and I'm using it on Ubuntu Linux right now. Uh, we just do a sudo apt-get install TCP Traceroute to install this tool. But this is a fantastic way to validate that that path is good or to validate that that path is being blocked. So I hope this helps you out in your network troubleshooting, and we'll keep pumping out more videos.